Hey guys, Kevin here with eTrailer, and today we're going to be talking about the Valterra RV Ceiling Register. The register is very easy to use. You can simply spin it around or push your shutters in to prevent air from flowing through or back open to have your air filter out. It comes in a variety of different colors to match the aesthetics of your motorhome or trailer and comes in a variety of different sizes to fit multiple applications. Over time, plastic can start to get pretty brittle, so after repeated use of your shutters, you may run into some issues where these just really don't want to work anymore or start to get stuck and broken, or maybe your cover starts to kind of stick too much and doesn't really want to spin so that you can put your airflow exactly where you need it. So that's where these replacement vent covers come in to easily solve your issue. As far as installation goes, it is easy peasy. It's only a few seconds to simply pop out your old register and the base and pop in your new one. Let me show you how we did that. So to begin our installation, we would normally start by removing first the actual shutters and then our base, but our neighbors already pulled it out since well, they broke one of their shutters. Uh, but typically all you have to do is just easily kind of just pull down and it'll pop right out. So we put that one back in place and then we can take down our base. So it's only gonna have three screws. You can easily pull out. And then we can slide our base out. So the next step would be to measure our cutout hole. Right here, it looks like we're sitting at five and seven eighths. So now we know exactly what kind of register cover that we're gonna need. So when you're looking at putting your base in, you are not crazy when you're sitting here and looking at it and seeing the mounting holes not line up. Um, it only goes one specific way. So right now I have all three holes, but if I turned it any other way, I would only see one hole. And I don't know why the manufacturer really does it that way, but that's just uh, unfortunately how it is. So now our next step would be to take our mounting hardware and put our base in place. Um, I'm just going to reuse these screws that we had just because they're in good shape. But if you needed to, you could just use what came with your kit. Now the last step is to simply just pop our cover into place. With our vent now in place, all we need to do is just kind of angle it to exactly where we want it to be and then push our shutters so that we have our airflow going the way that we want it and that will complete our installation of the Valterra RV vent register.